Hi, it's Teresa from Dodge Nature Center. And on this episode of Nature to Go, we're going to talk about right where we are, here in Minnesota. The land of sky-tinted water. The land of 10,000 lakes. La Toile du Nord. That's our state motto, Star of the North. We have a lot of state symbols, too. And I bet you know quite a few of them. Our state flower is the lady slipper. Our state tree is the Norway pine. And our state bird, the loon. We even have a state mushroom, the morel. And then there's the state fish, the walleye. Our state fruit is the honeycrisp apple. Our state grain, wild rice. We even have a state drink. That would be milk. Which would go great with our state muffin, the blueberry muffin. We even have a state soil. It's called Lester. It's a prairie soil. And of course, there's the agate, which is our state gemstone. Now you might have thought that our state insect is the mosquito, but we don't have an official state insect. We do have an official state bee, the rusty patch bumblebee. Our state butterfly, the monarch. Which brings us to kind of the reason why I wanted to talk about state symbols today. The one thing we don't have is a state fossil. Now, there are 43 other states that have fossils, and we don't have anything at all. That could be changing soon and with your help. The Science Museum of Minnesota is sponsoring an online contest to try to figure out what we should have as our state fossil. Now, they have several candidates, but in recent weeks, a write-in candidate has blown away the competition. And it's a, co a candidate that I totally agree with. It is a giant prehistoric beaver. Now, none other, no other state has anything like this at all. Okay, they've got some dinosaurs, but they also have things like petrified wood. But, but no other state has chosen as its fossil the giant prehistoric beaver. Okay, maybe they're not quite as giant as this, but they still are remarkably larger than the beavers that we're used to thinking of today. Head over to the Science Museum website and go to the page that asks you to participate in the survey. You can find out more information about all the different fossils they have available, but you'll also see the information about the giant prehistoric beaver. What a great thing to be able to participate in. Voting goes through October 1st and then October 13th, National Fossil Day. They'll announce who the winner is and then they'll approach legislators to see if we can make this our official state fossil. Thanks for joining me for this episode of Nature to Go. Get out there and vote and we'll talk to you again next time.